Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Shanika E and it's late girl. I am up prepping my hair for my appointment tomorrow. I will be installing four bundles of the Eunice Kinky Straight Hair. Shout out to Eunice for sponsoring this portion of the video. This is not my first rodeo with this hair. I'm obsessed. It blends with natural hair beautifully. You guys will see after my install tomorrow. It's everything. Good morning. It is Saturday morning. I am about to go ahead and begin flat ironing my hair. And the girl is tired. Aunt Flo came yesterday and I do apologize if my energy is low. So I am going to be using the T3 irons for the first time. I'll let you guys know my thoughts. So I will see you guys. I'll kind of run the B-roll while I'm styling my hair and then I'll come back and let you guys know my thoughts once I am done. Okay, look look at how thick the hair is. It, it is. it is everything. We'll get into it a little bit later on, but you can't really see it because I have on this black top and it's kind of like blending, but 
obsessed. If you're interested in this hair, it will be linked in the description bar down below, but girl, let's get into this fit. So I picked this top up from T Mew and it is so cute. It's like so on trend. It is like this knit, but it has like holes throughout, but it is too, too cute. If you didn't see my last video, it was a fashion video where I picked out a few pieces from T Mew. It was sponsored, but afterwards, girl, I went back on there with my own coin and started to shop. And this is one of the pieces I picked up. So, so cute. Underneath, I just have on a black bra and some tights for now because I'm just around the house. Very, very comfortable. Extremely cute. But anywho, girl, um, we need to go to get the back of my hair tightened up. It is a little bit loose in the back. I love the overall style of the hair. One thing that I will say is I'm a four bundle girl. I'm a four bundle girl. I love a nice, thick, full head of hair. But four bundles with this particular texture, mm, it's a little bit too much. <laughs> okay, so I'm getting like a little bit of bulk, but not because of the install at all, but just because like it is just so, so much hair, girl. You see, just like so much hair. So I'm gonna rock with it for this month, but when I reinstall the hair, I'm definitely gonna go with more of a three and a half bundle, but still very, very cute, very, very, my style and the blend is crazy, like crazy. The styles that I can do with the way she installed this, you guys seen like the up and the down, the flipped over to one side, all back in the ponytail, really, really cute. Anyway, girl, let me unbox um, some few fall pieces with you guys because I'm super excited, starting with a few pair of shoes. So the first pair of shoes I've already unboxed and I am obsessed and they are my Uggs. It is fall and if you know, you know, Uggs are just the perfect kick around shoe to go run your errands in, to go to the mailbox in and to travel in. I'm gonna be doing a lot of traveling back to Bama and these are going to be perfect for that. This is what they look like. Super cute. I mean, come on. Y'all see this. Ultimate comfort. It's like an elevated house shoe. I'm probably going to put these on today just to like go around the house in, but I love these. Now, for my wide foot girls, these are a little bit narrow. Not a lot, but a little bit. Traditionally, Uggs have a more wider profile, and these are... Mm, they're a little bit more narrow, but they're still everything, okay? Um, and to be honest, only reason why I'm even saying something is because the way I plan to style them is to be pairing them back with a nice chunky sock and athleisure wear. So the chunky sock is probably going to make the shoe a little snug, but it'll also help to stretch it out as well. So if you're interested in these, I will put them in the description bar down below. I don't remember where I picked these up, if they were from the Uggs site or were they from some other site. But either way, wherever I can find them, I will link them down below. They are true to size and I picked mine up in a size 10. So the next thing that I picked up is a pair of New Balance. You guys know I already have these New Balance here. I'm obsessed. My husband got these for me for my birthday. These are the, ooh, what are these? 2002R Energy. I love these, I love the colorway. I love that they have these nice muted like brown tones, super, super cute. But I also wanted the other profile. It's a little bit more chunkier silhouette. And I believe those are women's. And so I picked up another pair. I think these are called, Mm, 90s, 60s, I don't know, something like that, girl. All right, here is the shoe. I do really like the shoe. Again, this is a more narrow silhouette versus this silhouette here, but I do really like this. So on my days when I'm not wearing brown, these are going to be the shoe that I pop on. These are like a cream grays and a little bit of silver so it has kind of like that metallic trend that has been going on let me try these on 
to see if they're going to fit. Okay, okay, they fit and they're really cute. So I think I'm gonna keep them. I don't know, I'm not obsessed like I am with these. So we'll see, we'll see how I feel by the end of the day, but I think I like them. And I don't know if it's the color or what I have on right now that's kind of throwing me, but I was obsessed with them. Every time I seen a picture online, I was like, oh my God, I gotta have them. But having them here in my hand, I'm not like in love. What do you guys think? Do y'all like this silhouette of shoe? Let me know in the comments down below. I am going to style them up today for a reel for stories. So maybe my mind will change then. All right, so that is surprisingly all the packages I have right now. I do have a Team U package coming in. Like I said, girl, I'm obsessed. I'm hooked. <laughs> but it is going to be some glassware. Super excited about that. You guys seen the glass that I had this morning that I made my pumpkin spice latte in? That was thrifted and girl, that latte was so good. Let me go get the drink because I was doing my hair. Let me go get it. All right, so this was the drink that I made this morning, girl. It was so good i like savored it i could have like gulped it all the way down it was so good so it was the starbucks pumpkin spice latte i added in a little bit of frosted french vanilla creamer on top and then i had a shot of the starbucks espresso so so good so thick and like rich in flavor profile and then for the rim because of course i wanted to look cute girl <laughs> i put some caramel around the rim and then i kind of dipped it in pumpkin spice seasoning and then sprinkled some pumpkin spice on top girl so so good i'm gonna have to stop myself from making this i'm gonna limit myself to one a week because i'm sure the amount of sugar in here is just way too much but Really love that. But anyways, <laughs> I went and got this so you guys can see how cute the glass is. So I'm obsessed with like cute, like unique style glassware. And so I made an order from Team U. I'm gonna actually go downstairs to the mail room to see if they have it. And then we will unbox the glassware with you guys. But I love having a nice cocktail or coffee in cute glasses. It's just like a nice pick me up. It makes my day. So yeah, I am going to go ahead and finish up a little bit of work. I do have some training that I need to get done this week. So I need to be prepping for that. And then I'll pick you guys up a little bit later on when I am going downstairs to get my glassware. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys a little bit later. Bye girl. All right, I just pulled up to my stylist house. I'm gonna go ahead and go in and let her fix these back pieces. As you can see, sew in where? Baby, look how seamless the hair is. Like pulled up, Oh, I'm probably just gonna wear it like, you know, styled versus just wearing it down because it just is so much hair but it looks so good and natural like this. And baby, when I say flat, y'all see it, y'all see it. I'm obsessed. Um, but yeah, so I will talk to you guys when I get out of here and your girl energy is fluctuating so bad. Like I am on my cycle and it is whooping my ass. I am also anemic, so I'm like extremely tired, extremely moody. And it's been coming earlier and earlier. TMI, but we all women here mostly. I'm just saying, like, it's only so much a girl can take. It's coming like every three weeks. Like, good day. Oh, okay. I think we need to run the target when we leave here, but I will call my husband and see exactly what it is that we need because I'm not trying to be in target with the vibes. Okay. I'm trying to get in target, get what we need, and get out. So.
Christmas stuff, but look how cute these pillows are. And these pillows too. <laughs> so cute. Yeah, you are missing two. Let me see. Okay, very good. The next on the math side, it says trace the number six. How do you say trace in Spanish? Plaza. Very good. Okay.
All right, guys, so I have clocked out. I am on my lunch break and I am about to head into the thrift store because girl, I need a break. I need a mental break. So the thrift store always helps me to decompress. Plus I am looking for some fall jackets, some cardigans and like cute little cropped old lady jackets. <laughs> so let's see if we can find that child. My lips are so ashy, but of course I left everything in the office, but anywho, Let's go into Goodwill and see what we can find. package that I was telling you guys about the other day. This is my TMU package. This is all of, yeah, this is all of the glassware that I picked up. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this up and show you guys. I've already been up for a while doing some work. So happy to be working remotely today but yeah let's see what is in this bag hopefully the glassware is everything i'm needing it to be and i haven't drunk my first cup of coffee yet so we're gonna be doing so using one of these glasses let's see where are my scissors mm. let's see there we go all right girl let's see what team you has for us today all right, so everything is in this large Ziploc pouch. So let's see. I'm nervous, child, because I remember really loving everything that I got. And I hope I still love it equally when I open it up. All right, so the first piece of glassware is this cute glass here. I love the shape of this. It's like a stemless style glass. I am planning on putting like iced coffees in here, iced chai lattes. I'm not gonna put anything hot in here because it doesn't have a handle, but it is so, so cute. A cute little iced matcha. Love this. And I think all of the glasses were below $5, but I will link everything in the description bar down below. Super, super excited about this. The next glassware, let's see child. I don't remember all of them being so small, but I guess so. All right, ooh, cute. <laughs> this is the next one, very, very cute. I love the kind of just irregular shape on this. It's like several cylinders stacked on top of each other, super, super cute. This, a nice cocktail in this for like when me and my husband make cute drinks. Again, I would not use this for anything hot because it doesn't have a handle, but it is absolutely gorgeous. Okay, team you. <laughs> I'm liking everything thus far. Let's see, what is this one? Mm, child, I don't remember this. Oh, oh, I see, I see. This is the lid Ooh, to the other one. Now, this is the one I was most excited about because I seen this one years ago. I believe I seen this one first on the Glam Twins, maybe about two, two and a half years ago. And I remember following the link. Theirs was probably up close to $30. This one was 10. So super, super cute. All right, so we have the bottom of the cup here. I'm not really... Mm, sure what this is child all right but the lid sits on there like this ah! 
it is so cute and then of course it does come with the straw that goes with it now this other piece here i'm sure this is supposed to go around the rim of the glass so that the glass is not you know actually touching so i'll figure that out in a second but girl i think i like it yeah this was the first this was the first glassware that I seen that really sparked my interest to go ahead and do a complete glassware haul. Look how cute. Oh, look how cute. Any iced beverage in this? I am so excited. I'm probably going to put something in this today. A nice like lemon and mint water. Can you see that in here, girl? The aesthetics is going to be everything. I am obsessed. Super, super cute. I love the little dome top. Perfect for putting in like a nice whipped cream on top. Mm. Love that. Let's see. I know what this one is. Now I'm starting to remember. This one is the same as this cute little chubby one here, but it does have a handle. So I can put my hot drinks in this one and so <laughs> it's so cute look at it oh girl look how cute now now y'all right now they don't they don't look like much they're cute but they don't look like much because they're not filled with the liquid content but when i start making these on my b-rolls at the beginning of the vlogs remember these came from Timu. Look how cute. Oh my God. Oh my God. So again, something for a hot liquid. And then this one would be more so for something colder again, because it doesn't have a handle, but they're exact same glass, but just one with a handle. So cute. And I think both of these were under $5. Love that for me. Okay, I think these both are glassware as well, but if I'm honest, I'm looking at it and I think I'm a little disappointed because I thought they were gonna be larger. This is a two-piece set, but let's see what it's giving. <laughs> I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. So, so cute. And the fact that this is an all glassware haul and nothing, Nothing came scratched or broke. Shout out again to new packaging, but look at these. Very, very cute. Again, I love the shape on here. It's kind of like a teardrop, narrow at the top, wider at the base. They are slightly ribbed. Oh, so good. <laughs> love these, super, super cute. Again, these just for, you know, ice water or anything else you guys choose to put in there. I'm not a juice drinker or anything like that, but so, so cute. And again, anything like ice with one of my nice glass straws that I have from Amazon, super, super cute. Again, if you guys are interested in any of these glasses, I will link them in the description bar down below. Oh, and the last thing is this ice tray. Now, I was watching Kyra's vlogs. This was a while ago, but you know, Kyra always makes really nice, cute drinks. And she has like these circular ice cubes. So I picked up some myself. I have um, ice cube trays that are like hexagons. I have the ones that are larger ice cubes for, you know, my cocktails, larger circles, larger squares. But I thought this one would be nice for the cute like smaller circles super super cute so it's a two piece you just kind of open it up like this so you have the bottom and the top just a traditional a traditional old school tray or you can keep it closed here and there's like holes Ooh, the sun baby it's sunny anyways <laughs> the holes are in the top you can just fill it that way so prepare to be sick of me making all of my cute drinks but girl don't be jelly don't be jelly. Go get you some of these cute Team U glasses as well. This one is my favorite. So if I had to go in order, this one is my favorite. I just, I just love it. It is so cute, so elevated. And then my next favorite would be this one here. Mm. Love it.
right so while we are in the kitchen i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys my new in nespresso pods i am super excited they are both limited edition so i keep my nespresso pods right here underneath where i have my glassware and my um, coffee machine is here as well so let me show you guys what this drawer looks like how i organize it as well as showing you guys my new in pod so as i stated this is my coffee bar area and then above it is where i keep most of my glassware going to be adding in my new CMU pieces there it's looking a little bare over here because i normally have a beautiful flower arrangement but i have been under the weather girl if you did not know i've been gone so long because your girl had the vid and so <laughs> If I'm a little scatterbrained or all over this blog, girl, charge it to my head, not my heart. The vid got me spinning. But anywho, so below here, I keep my coffee and my teas. So on this side, I have my teas. The organizers are just individual organizers from um, Dollar Tree. These black ones are from Dollar Tree as well. This one is from Dollar Tree as well. But yes, this is where I keep my coffees and my teas in this drawer here but these are the two new ones that i want to show you guys this one i am saving for the latter holidays you know your thanksgiving your christmas this is the gingerbread super excited about this one um i think a sleeve girl don't give me the lion both of these sleeves that i picked up the total was about 35 dollars so I will link these down below if you're interested. And my husband has already got into this one. He loves it and I do as well. I tried his this morning. I'm gonna be making my first cup today and it is the pumpkin spice cake, girl. I was so happy when I went on the website and they still had these because normally these sell out very quickly so i don't know if they ordered more but yes super excited to go ahead and make my coffee and put them in one of my cute cups super excited it's the small things girl it's the small things in life that make me excited and then of course i keep my focus gummies here as well so i'm gonna go ahead and fill up these with my pots all right so i have quickly shifted everything down i still have my teas on this side and this is what the pumpkin spice ones look like outside of their wrapper super super cute like look how festive obsessed yeah let's go ahead and make one of these now smells so good oh so ready obsessed I'm just adding in a little bit of this French vanilla creamer to it. I'm gonna froth it. I picked this frother up from Target, I believe, but I do have it linked on my Amazon storefront. So if you're interested, check my Amazon storefront for this entire setup, both the Nespresso machine as well as the frother is on my storefront. garnished with some whipped cream and a little pumpkin spice seasoning on the top stop y'all i know i know y'all probably like girl we get it we get it but me baby me i'm gonna celebrate this win okay see y'all in a little bit all 
All right, y'all. So we're going to finish out this vlog showing you guys what I picked up from the thrift store yesterday. I did get two trench coats like I told you guys. So let me show you all these. They are two very lightweight coats. And so the first one is this beautiful like pearl iridescent like type of trench. I'm obsessed with it. It fits me so, so well. And it's gonna be like the perfect addition to like a really cute, like funky fit. I think it is absolutely gorgeous. I'm gonna turn the camera around so you guys can see all of it. Hold on. All right, so I'm gonna back up and show you guys what it looks like, but it has built-in shoulder pads. Not too strong though. You guys know shoulder pads are in this season, but look at this. Look how cute it is. Of course, I can button it up and do it closed, but look how cute. It has pockets. This is what it looks like in the back. Super, super, super cute. And it was $10.24. Again, I love a good statement coat for the fall. And baby, this, this is that. Love this. Let me show you guys the next one. So the next one is another trench, but this one is in like this black suede material. This one is a little bit more oversized. It says it's a size 10, but girl, this fits like a um, modern day 14 for me. Um, but I love it. I love that it's black and it is simple. Again, it has shoulder pads. These shoulder pads are a little bit more aggressive than the last jacket, which I really, really like. It also has a tie, which you can button this up or you can just tie it. But for now, I'm just going to tie it. Of course, if you want a more like buttoned up prim look, you could just tie it. But look at the length. It goes all the way down. Like, can you imagine this with some boots? Super, super cute. And you know me, I'm probably going to dress this one down with some sneakers, athleisure set underneath. And before it's like really, really cold, just kind of wear it open. I really, really like these. Again, very lightweight, perfect for the first part of the fall. And this one was, $10 and 24 cent as well. So both $10 and 24 cent. Obsessed, really, really cute. But again, I did not get to get much footage for you guys when I was in the thrift store because girl, I was on lunch <laughs> and I was trying not to be late. So I am going to go ahead and take you guys on like a full thrift trip with me to my favorite place, Park Avenue Thrift, but that will be in a later vlog. I also kind of talked to you guys on my community post about potentially doing a vlog week within October. I wanted so badly to do vlogtober, but girl, I got sick. And then after getting sick, work has just been working, okay? I've been working really hard, but it's supposed to slow down next week. So I'm going to try, <laughs> I'm going to try to upload a video every day next week. Mm, don't hold me to it, because here's the thing. Here's the thing. I love creating content. I love vibing with you guys. I do want to do this full time at some point, but your girl got a nine to five. <laughs> and being able to film, edit, and upload content while having a nine to five is tough. While having a five-year-old and a husband and cooking meals and cleaning is tough. So I'm gonna try, if I don't get to seven videos, maybe I'll do five, girl. If I can't get to five, I'll do three. But we're gonna have a minimum of three videos. <laughs> three videos or three vlogs next week, so stay tuned for that. 
I'm also about to go ahead and stop this vlog and start the next one. It's going to be a weekend vlog. I am going to be going to a birthday dinner celebration tonight. So I'm really excited about that. That's why I have this fresh face all day today, girl, because we're going to beat this face down <laughs> tonight for that. So again, I'm going to head to stop the vlog here, start that vlog. But thank you guys so much for rocking with me. I truly appreciate you guys. And if you enjoy my vibe, please make sure to go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I would love to have you a part of the fam bam. And again, if you're interested in this hair, girl, obsessed. If you're interested in this hair, the information for it will be in the description bar down below. Again, this is by the brand Eunice. Shout out to Eunice for sponsoring this video. And I will see you guys, I don't know, a couple days. <laughs> Let's see you guys in a couple days. Bye, girl. You cannot stay in environments where people don't know the true value of you. If you stay in environments where people don't recognize the value of you, you will shrink your gift to the size of what they can stand. And that's what causes anxiety and depression and stress because you have had to shrink into a form where people can tolerate you. I refuse to be small because you think small. I'm not shrinking my vision because you can't catch up. You either better roll with me or you gonna get rolled over.